Relationships are key. If I could reach through this camera and give you a handshake and a hug right now, I would. Hey there, my name is Brad Smith, owner and founder of HealthLinks.com. It's my mission and my passion to help others with their business. So if I can be your coach, your mentor, or help you in any way, that's my goal. My goal is to bring you value. So let me know if there's anything I can help you with, and I look forward to working with you. Hey guys, today I want to talk about relationships and why they're the most important aspect of building and growing your website. Now when I first started my website, Expert Training, I had no idea what I was doing. But when I look back at it now, I was able to build relationships with everybody that hit my website through testimonials and videos. I didn't have a plan, I didn't have a structure, but eventually it all worked out. I ended up getting new customers from that site because I had those videos, I had blogs, and I had testimonials. It was a way for them to build a relationship with me without actually having to meet me face to face. And that's what I want to talk about today is how you can build a relationship with everybody that visits your website. We all know that it's a lot easier to sign someone up when you shake their hand and meet them face to face. So we need to get in the mindset of how we can transform that over to your website. You obviously can't shake their hand and meet them face to face, but there are tools and different techniques you can do to build some sort of relationship with them. You can start writing blogs and content. This is a good way for the reader to find out what your business is all about and what you offer. You can also create videos like I'm doing right here. In the video, explain what you offer, who you are, and how you can help them. This is the best way that we found to build a relationship with an online visitor. Now, I'm not talking about social media videos that you're posting about your life or just about your business or promoting or marketing. I'm talking about real personal videos to build that relationship. Now below, I'm gonna show you a, a video, if you read the rest of this blog, where I'm gonna tell you exactly what to say on some of those beginning videos when someone hits your site. The third thing is audio. If you don't feel comfortable being on video, you can do audio, like a podcast, or some sort of audio on your site, so they can hear your voice, hear what you offer, and how you can help them. Now if you tie all three of these together, that's where you're gonna see the best results. If you do all three, add consistency and your website is just gonna explode and grow. If you're just offering one that's totally fine, find what's comfortable and just start adding and being consistent with the one, two, or three pieces of content that you're offering. Now a lot of people ask me, well what about the quality, the highest quality? That's something that you don't need to worry about yet because what if you just waited and waited and waited till you got high quality and nothing ever came out? Now your website's just staying stale and you're not getting more growth. Start with something. Start with something you're comfortable with. Audio, video, articles. Doesn't matter the quality. Once you get consistent and make a game plan, you'll start getting better and better and better to build up the higher quality, but at the same time you're able to build relationships. Website visitors don't care how awesome your video is. They want to know who you are and if they want to buy from you before they make it to the purchase section. Now consistency is even more important than all of these because if you don't do anything, you're not gonna see growth. So plan something in your schedule every week, every month, just something consistent, put it in your schedule. They say if it's not in your schedule, it never will happen. So put it in the schedule once a week, once a month. We recommend once a week. We some, see some people doing it daily. Whatever you feel like you could be consistent with, put that in your schedule and make sure you do it. Hopefully this helped. I encourage you to read the rest of the article. Hopefully it brought you some value. You'll also see the video below that's gonna show you what to say on your videos. And I hope that helps. I hope you guys have a great day.